okay now we are going to look at schema modification in this we are going to see how do we create tables how do we delete tables how do we add constraints and so on and so forth okay schema modification we would begin with creating tables creating tables in SQL let's see how do we create tables in SQL first we will have a schema let's suppose I have an employee table I have employee name I have employee ID okay I have uh, say his phone number I have his email I have his department okay and we have another table department where I have the department name and I have the department manager okay so this is my schema which is I'm going to create using create table command of SQL okay so let's begin so I would have to create a table named EMP right so let's see how do we do that the keyword to create a table is create table okay that's very obvious right I would say create table and then I would start specifying my attributes so my first attribute is name then I would give its domain so I would say it is a varchar say 40 okay and then I can specify any constraints that I might have on name so I would say it is not none okay which means a null value on name is not allowed okay next I would have what do we have next I have employee ID okay employee ID I would say it is numeric 8 characters okay next I have phone number phone number also I would say it is numeric 10 characters okay next I have my email email would be suppose a varchar of 40 okay and I would say it is not null right and what do we have final email department after that we have department okay so I would say department again say varchar okay and say a varchar of 20 okay and also I would say it is not null right I can also specify default values for my attribute okay so let's suppose my company's phone number is one two three five six seven eight nine then I can say if you don't enter a value for phone number use this as the phone number okay so if I miss to enter phone number a default value of 01234567819 would be stored as the phone number 